Hello kids. We are gonna learn about something really, really fun today. We're gonna learn about a ballet dancer and her name is Misty Copeland. But we're also gonna learn about all of you today. And we're gonna learn if any of you have ever had experience in ballet or other dance classes. So let's get to our first question. Who here has ever taken a ballet class? Has anybody ever taken any other dance classes? Does anybody like to just dance at home? Let's take 30 seconds and let's have a share time. Go ahead and share your answers with the class. Okay, everybody, time's up. Did everyone get a chance to share their answers and tell everyone about their dancing experience? Let's ask another question. Does anybody know what is a ballet dancer and what ballerinas do? If so, make sure to raise your hand. Let's take another 30 seconds and go ahead and share your answers with your class. Okay kids, time's up. Did you know that a ballerina is a dancer? I bet some of you did know that. Ballerinas dance on the top of their toes and many ballerinas begin dancing at a very young age, like five or six years old. Today, we are learning about Misty Copeland. Misty Copeland is a ballerina, but she did not begin dancing at five or six years old. She didn't start dancing until she was 13 years old. Let's take a look at what ballet dancers do. American Ballet Theatre presents B is for Ballet, A Dance Alphabet by John Robert Allman, illustrated by Rachel Dean. A is for the arabesque, a quintessential pose performed with outstretched arms and legs and perfect pointed toes. B is for the ballet bar where dancers learn to balance also for Barishnikov's extraordinary talents. C is for the company, beginning with the core, then soloists and principals who make Coppelia soar. Did everybody like that video? I thought it was pretty cool. So we got to see a little bit about what ballet dancers do every day. And as you can see from the clip, 
Most of those kids started when they were very, very young in the dance school to become ballet dancers when they become grown-ups. There are some people though, like Misty Copeland, that don't start ballet when they're really, really young, like all of you. They start when they're older, like she did. Those people are called prodigies. Do you know what a prodigy is? A prodigy is someone who is really, really good at something, better than almost anyone else. They are some of the best in the world at what they do. That's like Misty Copeland. Misty Copeland is a ballet prodigy, and she is one of the best in the world. Let's take a look at Misty Copeland dancing. The best of Misty Copeland. Okay kids, let's have one more share with each other. Can you name one thing that you are really, really good at like Misty is with ballet? Maybe you can turn to the friend who's next to you and you can take turns telling each other one thing that you're each very good at. Let's take 30 seconds and share with each other. Okay, everyone, that's all for now. I hope you enjoyed learning about Misty Copeland as much as me. I wanna wish all of you a very happy Black History Month. See you later.